so in basic basic mathematics we have already covered the log or uh, the properties of log right and now we are covering the arithmetic progression or you can say the progression where we will discuss all the types of progression right the first topic is the first type is arithmetic progression so let's start so this is definition of arithmetic progression these are the uh, um, we, we all are not interested in uh, definition right so in short i am just uh, explaining you the definition right if the uh, difference between any pair of uh, numbers is same or a constant in every pair that is the common difference then it is an series of ap or you can say it's an arithmetic progression series so you can see the definitions here one definition one two and let's move on now what are the notations in arithmetic progression so these are the three notations that we used like the common difference that is represented by d and the nth term that is a n and the sum of nth term is represented by sn right now uh, how we find the common difference the common difference is if uh, like a2 minus a1 a3 minus a2 what is a1 a2 a3 these are the uh, uh, you can say series or you can say the numbers in the series right this is uh, a1 is the first term a2 is the second term a3 and similarly a n is the nth term in an ap common difference is d right so if the d is same for all like a2 minus a1 or you can say a3 minus a2 or you can say a n minus a n minus 1 if this uh, the difference between all these pairs is same then you can say it's an arithmetic progression series so the question is how to find the first term of ap or any other term of ap so first term uh, ap can be also written in terms of common differences like hum ap ko is type se likh sakte hain a a plus d a plus 2d in every term if we will add d then the next uh, number will be generated right and similarly for the nth term a plus n minus 1d where a is the first term right let's move on and uh, what are the formulas for the nth term of an ap and what are the uh, what is the formula for sum of nth term firstly we are looking at the nth term of an ap and its formula is a plus n minus 1d a we already know it's a first term right a n is the nth term or the term that we want to uh, find like uh, if i want to find the third uh, term of the ap then n is 3 for me right and n is 3 right and d you already know the common difference a is the first term so let's move on quickly this is the example like to find the n term of an ap 1 2 3 4 5 up to a n if the number of terms are 15 so the question already uh, says uh, we have 15 terms so n is 15 and we have to find the nth term that is the 15th term so solution is here uh, n is 15 we have a series of ap how because 2 minus 1 is 1, 3 minus 2 is also 1, so it's all same, for, uh, it's same for all, so it's an ap, right? And already the question says it's an ap. So by the formula we uh, know n is equals to a plus n minus 1d, it's a formula we already know. So first term is here, 1. So a is 1. And common difference we already find, uh, find out 2 minus 1, right? So it's 1. So therefore, the 15th term will be 1 plus 15 minus 1 into d, that is 1. So overall, 1 plus 14 equals 15. So this was the simple uh, question on ap. Let's move on. So now question comes is uh, how to find the sum of n terms of an ap. So there is a formula like n by 2, 2a plus n minus 1 into d as you can see here. This, was, uh, this is the formula for finding the sum of n terms. You know already what is n and you all know uh, you also know what is a in the first term and d is the common difference so let's an example uh, you have to find or you can uh, you have to find the addition of these all numbers in an ap series right so the first term is a and the common difference you can find by 2 minus 1 or 3 minus 2 it's 1 and there are 15 term uh, 15 numbers so you can say the n or nth term is 15 so how to find the sum of n terms you have already a formula n by 2 to a plus n minus 1 into d so put 15 on in place of n you already know a is 1 so 2 into 1 is 2 plus 15 minus 1 is 14 and 14 into 1 d is already 1 so it's, uh, it's 40 so after solving this you you will get the answer as 120 is the sum of all these numbers and you can recheck uh, as you know uh, how to find the sum of n natural number by the using formula n into n plus 1 by 2 if you don't know this i will make another video another video on it right 
so has the sum of the uh, first 15 natural numbers is 120 so let's move on to the next so uh, you also have another uh, formula uh, to find the sum of happy series uh, that is n by 2 into first term plus last term but uh, for this you should know what is the first term and the last term of the series if you don't know the last term you cannot apply this formula so you can also apply here and uh, let's apply in this form in this question like first term was 1 plus last term was 15 15 plus 1 16 and n by 2 that is 16 into 15 by 2 that is 15 into 8 and 15 is a 120 so this is same as you can also apply this formula over there and this is the list of the formula that we have already seen previously so you can you or you may note down from here and the this is the homework for you all guys like the uh, question one two three these are the three questions that you have to solve on and also you can comment the answer in the comment section right and i will check uh, your answer or you if you may get uh, any doubt i will solve it uh, over there so that's all in this video uh, we have seen the the basics of progression that is the first arithmetic progression and in next video we will see the uh, geometric progression and also the harmonic progression right uh, so guys if you like this video you can subscribe my channel and also share it and please click on the bell icon so that you will be notified by our next video and we'll see next video mein ek nahi algorithm or ek nahi question ke see you bye bye